Section 9A of the Immigration Act provides for the grant of occupation permits to non-citizens to reside and work as investor, self-employed and professional, whereas Section 9B of the same Act provides for the grant of residence permits to retired non-citizens. In regard to Part A of the question, I am informed by the Economic Development Board that on 23rd July 2013, Mr. PRMG, a French national, was issued an occupation permit valid until 22nd July 2016 to stay and work in Mauritius as sales and marketing director with Jackie Diving Limited based at Pointe-Coton in Rodrigues under the category for professional. On 4th of July 2016, Mr. PRMG submitted an application for renewal of his occupation permit through the then Board of Investment. The application was examined by the Joint Committee comprising representatives from my office, the Passport and Immigration Office, and the Board of Investment. The Joint Committee did not recommend the application for renewal of the permit, as the Ministry of Tourism considered that it was not within the scarcity area for the tourism sector. Subsequently, Jackie Diving Limited made an appeal for the application of Mr. PRMG to be reconsidered on the grounds that the non-citizen was responsible for the development and promotion of diving activities of the company and there was a lack of qualified persons in that field in Rodrigues. The Ministry of Tourism considered the grounds of appeal and recommended the application in November 2016 to the then Board of Investment. The case was referred to the Joint Committee and the application of Mr. PRMG was recommended favorably. On the 9th of November 2016, my office accordingly conveyed to the Passport and Immigration Office and the then Board of Investment, the approval for the extension of the occupation permit of Mr. PRMG. Thus, on the 16th of November 2016, the Passport and Immigration Office issued the renewal of the permit to allow Mr. PRMG to continue to work with Jackie Trading, where Jackie Diving Limited, valid until 27th of July 2019. Madam Speaker, in regard to Part B of the question, I am informed that in a letter dated 19th of January 2018, the Chief Commissioner's Office of the Rodrigues Regional Assembly reported to my office that Mr. PRMG had been accused of fraud in France. This information was relayed on the 24th of January 2018 to the Passport and Immigration Office and the Economic Development Board, who were both requested to carry out an inquiry into the matter and submit a report with a Please, please hey. proceed, Robert, Prime Minister, please proceed. Where, where is the problem? No, no, please proceed. I haven't stopped uh, you. Fumi, Fumi Rose. Yeah. On va aller. Un peu lent. I'll get to no, constitution to party. No, please proceed. Obigadou, même pédia. Obigadou, no, même pécosé. Please. No comment. On va l'arranger. On va l'arranger. On va l'arranger. Please. Honorable Béranger, please. Honorable Béranger, please calm down. Honorable Prime Minister, please continue. I think he needs to cool down a lot. 
I can understand the heat and the him. Pesofe. Come on, Constitution. This is this information was relayed on the 24th of January 2018 to the Passport and Immigration Office and the Economic Development Board, who were both requested to carry out an inquiry into the matter and submit a report with a view to taking a decision on the occupation permit held by Mr. PRMG. The Passport and Immigration Office had, through the Mauritius Police, sought the assistance of its French counterparts to verify the information. In the meantime, the Passport and Immigration Office had, on the 12th of April 2018, recorded a statement from Mr. PRMG, who indicated that on 9th of December 2017, he learned through the internet that a judgment had been delivered by the Tribunal Correctionnel de Nantes on 7th of December 2017 in his absence in France, whereby he was convicted on the charges of, I quote, escroquerie fait commis depuis le 6 janvier 2014 et jusqu'au 22 octobre 2015 à Nantes, Villeux de Bretagne, unquote, and, I quote, recel de biens obtenus à l'aide d'une escroquerie fait commis du 6 janvier 2014 au 14 juillet 2014 à Nantes, Vigneux de Bretagne et sur le territoire de Maurice. Unquote. He was sentenced to one year imprisonment and to refund to Paul Emploi des Pays. On appelle Béranger several times, several times from a sitting position. I'm sorry, order please. Several times from a sitting position, you've said shame on me. I would ask you to withdraw this word because I know I control the number of minutes that the, each of you give your reply and ask your questions. This is my responsibility. And it's not up to you to say that shame on me. Please proceed, Honorable Prime Minister. The way the Prime Minister giving his reply. Purpose. That is purpose just to offer to evade other questions. You are losing time, and another half an hour will go. And he's occupying four ministries. If you, say, you find this normal. Honorable, honorable, you find, please sit down. Please sit down. Honorable Bagwan, please sit down. Honorable Bagwan, sit down. Please sit down. Honorable Bagwan. Third time, Honorable Bagwan, please sit down. Honorable members, Honorable members, let me draw your attention to the fact that interruptions can only cause disorder in the House. Honorable members, if you continue, I'll suspend. If you continue, okay? Then finish your debate. I suspend the session. I suspend the sitting.